well A rhythm put my mind at ease From this life my thoughts I lease Aren't we all from gifted dreams? I'm about to hiccup this hypocrisy From mass death to mass thought Moving through the streets and deep I'm bringing hippie love Make it with the peace Release deep breaths Hold time to think In fact, maybe think about another being Getting work these days, it ain't so quick Put a hundred applications, make one stick But shit, it really ain't that bad, kid We definitely have it better than most did So take a second, what could you do? Give the clothes off your back in a pair of shoes Nah, they only need a little bit of change Maybe they need a drink for a bad day Said I can't say much cause I've been there too Haven't we all just needed a brew? It's true So I move fast, crash fast, pay it for a fractal back as I sit and laugh. <laughs> I'm back to the paper and pen Left side brain making up the plan Looking for the good people God send Where's Waldo with the game in this world we're living in? Freeze, take a second, hold the thoughts, speak Why do we gotta look for good people in the grease? Excuse me, but I plan to breathe Dedicate my life to this new look perceived But damn, if I be the son of Sam There's always something smaller for my master Relax on some grass, keep rocks on some dance That'll build a dent real fast So please take my style with much ease No blatant ideology will come through me Just steady breathing flow with the conscious take full Living my life till I feel this love flow Check it Yeah Said I move fast, grab fast, pay it for a crackle back as I sit and laugh. Said I move fast, crash fast, pay it for a crackle back as I sit. Take time a day to make time for faith in those who can't keep their own habits at bay. Yeah, sometimes it's just too late. So I pay you. Gorilla Studios. It's Tuesday. Yeah, I know. Tuesday. But we've got a special show for you guys. Welcome, Nora Curse. Hey, my name is Haru. I play under Nora Curse. Um, 
my friends from Massachusetts are here on tour tonight, so you should probably donate to them if you if you can. They're really, really good. I used to play with and book them all the time uh, when I lived there. Um, okay, I'm going to start. Uh, this first one is a really sad cover of a really upbeat song from like 2009. Probably need to turn that up. <laughs> Head underwater, and you tell me <clears throat> to breathe easy for a while. Breathing gets harder. Even I know that Make room for me It's too soon to see If I'm happy in your hands Unusually hard to hold on to Blank stairs and blank pages no easy way to say this You mean well But you make this hard on me I'm not gonna write you a love song Cause you ask for it Cause you need one You see, I'm not gonna write you a love song Cause you tell me it's make or break in this And you're on your life I'm not gonna write you to stay If all you have is leaving I'm gonna need a better reason to write you A love song today Today oh, I learned the hard way That they all say The things you wanna hear Sings deep down under you and your twisted words. Your health just hurts. You are not what I thought you were. Say hello dry and dry. Convince me to please you. Make me think that I need this too I'm trying to let you hear me as I am I'm not gonna write you a love song Cause you ask for it, cause you need one You see, I'm not gonna write you a love song Cause you tell me it's make or break in this And you're on you I'm not gonna write you to stay If all you have is leaving I'm in need of a reason to write you A love song and today and Today oh, Promise me That you'll leave the light on To help me see Daylight, my guide gone, cause I believe there's a way You can love me because I say I'm gonna write you a love song Cause you ask for it, cause you need one You see, I'm not gonna write you a love song Cause you tell me it's make or break And this is why you want it
<laughs> that was Love Song by Sarah Borillis, if you remember that from the radio in 2009. <laughs> okay, um, this next one is called Supreme Court. <laughs> Change, I gotta stand up for this guy. Um, 
Pega aí, pô. Ah, mano. Okay, this next song is called Hangover, and I almost faint every time I play it, so let's hope that that doesn't happen. Oh, wait, actually, I'm not going to play Hangover yet. I'm going to not do that until a second later. I'm going to play Hangover. <laughs> okay, that one goes... My insides still taste like Crown Royal I promise I'm loyal I get drunk and spoil My hard-earned life can't you tell I'm waiting for someone to save me? But I guess no one's left, so I'll do my best. It's not right to waste your time while I try to find a peace in my mind. I should say, I should communicate, shouldn't hold it in till I'm drinking. Like all the nights I pass by Drinking to amplify what I feel like When I need to say I need to talk I gotta take more walks Can't you tell I'm waiting for whiskey to save me The poison on the roof The boys in the friend group are trying time I promise I'll try I promise I'll try I should communicate what's on my mind instead of blacking out and acting out all the time inside so oh wait no Hey, James, remember when I was 23 and I could do the pop punk suite perfectly? <laughs> All right, this one's called Hangover, and I almost faint every time I play it. Okay, I guess I'm not doing that with distortion. It's being weird. <laughs>
All right, um, this last one's called Comorbidity, and I think my friend the Michael character is going up next. Okay, um, yeah. <laughs> So I'll just have to turn it down when I do it. Okay. It's called comorbidity. Whoa! 
but you can use for me. curse all right coming up next is the michael character if you could join us on stage sir <laughs> all right ladies and gentlemen the michael character Hello, hi, hello. Can do a little bit of a reset here. Um, um, so, uh, my name is James, plays the Michael character here from the city of Boston, Massachusetts. And Peru's fucking unbelievable. That was crazy. I don't know how you do that. Vocally, that's uh, actually baffling to me. Um, <laughs> I mean, kind of same, but I don't. That doesn't imbue me with the power to be dope like that. Um, okay, Let's see if I can get this all. Uh, okay. Oh, marvelous. Okay. So I'm just gonna do some tunes for you. Uh, <coughs> Just gonna sing about my uh, sing about my leftist bullshit, and then uh, and <laughs> and then get out of your way, and then Eleanor Lecter's gonna help, uh, come up and play some tunes. It's gonna be great. So uh, uh, this is a song about uh, pardoning war criminals. I wrote it in uh, December of 2020. Eric Prince should have long been in the last jail. Rooming with the pardoned murderers of Nisor Square. Abolish every other corner of the prison system. But we can sort the fate of empire's handmaids after Christ we risen. Oh, enjoy your new job at Raytheon. We're all complicit, so let's go. Come on. Aerial bombardment makes death's attribution hard. So we can terrorize a lot of people. Northrop Grumman and Boeing Man. We can make it on the new Afghanistan. Trillions of dollars pissed away to private hands. And a devastated ailing population. But sanctions destabilize society. Manufacture scarcity and misery. In pursuit of so called national security. But tormenting the people is the policy. Cause banana worker 
Sanders couldn't hear the 20s roar in Magdalena. There's a million Indonesians buried with the PKI. El Mozote's ghosts are crammed into detention centers and the jury's out on how many in Yemen still will die. So enjoy your new job at Draper and that fucking robot dog. The machinery of empire hands close to market logic. So we'll keep marching on, kid. Yeah. We'll keep marching on. Ah, 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 ah. On New Year's Day. Sickness took hold my fragile body. Some time away from my routines, a little acetone to break apart the bonds in me. So I'm a pile of inflamed mucous membrane, lymph nodes, tender sinus headache. It's been four days and I haven't accomplished goddamn anything. Oh, whoa. Meanwhile, on the world stage, the empire slaps a stamp on the end of days. Yeah, licks the seal and sends it away with a press report saying drone assassination's okay. False pretense for to unbalance in favor of NATO, the regional powers. Intervention is his back, full throttle, man, thanks Obama for the Libyan model. What does it look like to live against empire? What are the metrics of efficacy? Cause there are people who've been at it for decades But here we are on the threshold of war again State Department talking heads yelling Every American kitchen Hateful xenophobic dipshits Hold hands tight with imperialist war hawks Left and right and the self-righteous liberals Show their true colors approving state terror just questioning the plan for what's coming so here i am on the couch again elderberry effervescence final fantasy 7 trying to go to bed by 6 45 for the energy to kick it with milner for the last time Tomorrow we dine, breakfast at Steve's 8.30, so we beat the line as thousands of people pour into the streets. I'll be nursing my sick ass to hell for a week, and hopefully when I can breathe again, I can do my little part to halt the storm that's coming. <clears throat> Thanks. That was, um... <coughs> Yeah, a song about pardoning Blackwater contractors and a song about uh, the assassination of <coughs> Qasem Soleimani. Here's, a, here's a, a totally different angle. This is a song about working at a restaurant uh, when you're 17 and a, a, a very poorly funded family-owned restaurant that eventually got shut down by the... Uh, we, you know, there's a sushi restaurant and they had like... I used to have... They had a butcher who would, you know, have blood all over him. And I remember one day seeing him hang up his butcher's apron with the blood dripping right into a vat of soy sauce, and then we got shut down. <laughs> but this is about what happened before that. We sent the sushi chef to do reconnaissance at the chain cafe next door. I couldn't figure out how they managed to keep the noise down with the blender spinning all around. Well, turns out they just had better hardware. My boss built a small wooden cover and did jack shit to dampen the sound of the bubble tea slushes getting ground down, ground down. Can't complain at 7.15 an hour. 2007, 17 and no power. 14 hour shifts and cash pay peel out in my mom's gray Camry. My town still means all that to me. Springsteen dreams of a Jersey teen who hadn't really heard all that much Springsteen yet. Thanks. <laughs> Try a new one. The car is coming closer on my little screen. You can 
real cool on the sidewalk in my slim cut jeans. I'm reading the Yelp reviews for the Holocene because consumer is my primary identity. I read conditions back into a moral code. Yeah, the good like me deserve a real home. And when I get real sick, I can take a whole day. I'll pop to the mini clinic for a $20 copay. Did I work for all the things I got? My high birth and my union job Benefits won through struggle I wasn't yet present to play my little part in Obsessed with what people deserve Like everything you get you must have earned So we reject the universal guarantee of social goods For everyone on earth Just for being human Not as payment for some worker Based on any other bullshit valuation of our worth Why? So now you're like, you're like a, a populist, but in the sense of a jest for small business owners. A Jeffersonian yeoman using Corby Lay for infrastructure. I'm cosplaying the working class. Had in my elite diploma, bought a house with family cash, but the equity is mine to hold. But ordinary working people hustle just to scrape a couple scraps of dignity and comfort from the plate. Expect it to be frugal and avoid emergencies. The kind from which they run the risk of losing everything. But if you come from money and you've never been without, you could blow a thousand dollars on a table for your house and never face the scrap. Scrutiny a waste of what you got because austerity is for those needy folks and not for you. Did I work for all the things I got? Stolen land, the too many cops, big capitals, tag team with the state, coercion for private property. Obsessed with keeping things the same, like natural law prevents substantial change. So we reject his utter fantasy, the concept of the social wage, our health and home and transportation, our basic needs understood as high quality public goods. You shouldn't need a credit score to live. You shouldn't need $5,000 down to have a place to raise your kids. She gets a little hairy when the things a person needs are granted the same status as a mere commodity. Cause like the market and the profit motive do a decent job of getting 13 Burt's Bees flavors, but not of compensating people for their labor or keeping life affordable for people who don't own any capital. Like it. All right, so uh, here's a here's a quiet tune. Futurity takes planning of whatever kind. Horizon is lunch tomorrow for the end of your grandchildren's lives. Maybe it's flexible and wait and see. Probably falls into one or two piles, both shaped by ideology, whether unconscious or crafted to match your style. Pile one, people plan for a future that looks like an infinite present. Maybe things change here and there, but some things are forever. Property's value and their bloodline or whatever. Pile two, people plan for something very different. Maybe it's climate collapse, water wars, or the limits of infinite growth, infinite violence, infinite consumption, infinite time to exploit last chances. The infinite gaps in our material standing. The infinite precarity of everyday living. The infinite wealth of our aristocrats' kids. So anyway, since you asked me how I'm doing, I've been trying to drag myself to the credit union to inquire about a mortgage pre-approval. But then I get to thinking about my visions for the future. Of the 30 years of steady living that I'd be assuming. Of the normatively patterned life I tell myself I'm choosing. Of the pension that I think will be there for me to collect. Of the pleasures of retirement I'll sample till I'm dead. 
the children that will maybe have and the cool lives they'll be living thanks to the universal high quality public goods will win of neighborhood based health clinics free at the point of service of universal child care in one big fucking union but I haven't been to the credit union yet so I can't even shop around to see what I can get no I can't even shop around to see what I can get no I can't even bring myself to make that one move Yeah, thanks. So um, I think I think I'm gonna uh, uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna call it prematurely to give the sound people a break. Um, so uh, I've, I I'm really delighted. I've been on tour for about two weeks now and got a couple weeks left um, with Eleanor Electra, who's one of my favorite uh, artists in the whole world. Um, she's amazing. She's a wonderful songwriter. Um, and she has a guitar that plugs in. So uh, uh, all, all wonderful things to look forward. So stick around. Uh, she's going to come up here and, and rip some, some crazy shit for you. So, uh, you know, that's where it's at. Thank you. Cool. Oh. Come on up, Elle. I'm going to keep the seat warm for you so there's something for the camera. I'll do some... I'll do some modeling. Oh, I can't even play that anymore. No, if I, I, I used to shred my voice and now, I probably could get away with it, but I wouldn't be able to sing or talk for like three weeks. So uh, life's different now, you know? All right, thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, thank you, the Michael Project. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up again. Uh, coming up next. Eleanor Electra. Did you want this here? Put it where the chair is. Nope, I'll put the chair where the mic is. Test, test. Let's give another round to the Michael character at Hiru. Wow, such incredible performances. Um, my name is Eleanor Electra, as previously mentioned by two different people, and I'm going to play some originals for you. Spring color 
Escape the earth in winter days and out of place. The struggle is incessant. Now I'm once again in the bright light. Smile like a winning crest and then I just will not give in. No amount of anger, no amount of complaining. I've seen the parts true. I've seen the haze on Dallas smog like fever. <clears throat> All right, here's kind of a slow one um, called Me and My Friend. And um, it is, I wrote it um, when I was, during the pandemic, my roommate was sick and I was taking care of her. And I was always also kind of taking care of me and my like ongoing health issues. So and it's also about being like a musician and um, how it, it's kind of hard to get by sometimes.
as in water, face meets face. So in you, I see me. Oh, I would not test the depth with both feet. No, I would cling to something when. So my blood is conveyed And the undecipher river flood as a coin And held by concrete In the town You're a small fish Looking at this screen for so long, I'm starting to feel it. I've been looking at this fire for so long, I'm starting to steal it. Looking at this screen for so long. Thank you. I'm from the West Coast, and it feels so awesome to be back on the West Side. Like the area that we're in right now reminds me so much of Southern or er, uh, Eastern Oregon and Southern Oregon as well, which is you know close to where I grew up. So good feels over here. Um, now I'm gonna play a song about my. Oh, more friends. I, it's, uh, it's as if I only write about that, which would be a completely worthy thing to spend my life writing about. Um, this is for um, a song I wrote for my roommates that I lived with for many years, and I just moved out, and I wrote them this little love song. Um, and um, also, it was kind of a request. I actually didn't, like, <laughs> I sort of, like, asked through this song if it was okay to sort of, like, um, like a crash at the house after my uh, my lease had ended. Um, so.
Thanks. How's everybody feeling out there? Are we good? Okay. Yeah, this is a really cool spot. Uh, we're just, we're, we're traveling. It's our first time here, so I don't know what usually goes on here, but I'm very grateful to be invited into your space. Um, let's see. Oh. Thank you very much. Um, should I play another song? Or? Yeah, like one more? Okay, one more. All right, I'm going to play something called Protector.
to the wall and the air squeaks when touched it's that old all of me Still I'm laughing I roll the bones gnashing Looking at the mouth of my protector Was she woman? Oh, I tell you Oh, I tell you
Thanks. That was very enjoyable for me. Thank you so much for listening and for having this space and for booking the show and doing sound and everybody in the stream. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to get off now. (laughs) Yes. Yes. Thank you. Let's give it up again for our three artists here at Ray Gorilla Studios. Nora Crush. The Michael character and uh, Lorna Electra. Thank you guys. We'll see you on Thursday for the next show. Big Rick, hope we get well soon. We'll see you soon. Have a good night, guys.
Then I swam across the river Then I ran just as fast as I could I jumped myself a train You know the law is looking for me Yeah, the law is looking for me Thank uh-huh. you.